This is the Glen Rose Cannery. It rests on one of the historically significant areas that will be destroyed as part of the South Perimeter Road Project and the Gateway Project. The cannery represents an important part of the history of the South Fraser region and in this area and the area of the lands beneath the cannery are important historical cultural artifacts which are all being destroyed, paved over as part of the road project. This site here is the Gunrose Cannery and just over here we have the St. Mungo's site. Both of these uh, were part of a 1973 uh, University of British Columbia archaeological study which in a very small area of only like six square foot at each dig found more than 15 bodies, hundreds of artifacts. Um, there's a number of statistics if you look up the 1970, uh, 1972 UBC study. But it's interesting to note that these sites, the history is so rich, it's a matter of thousands, 10,000 years, older than Stonehenge, older than the pyramids, these two um, sites where these ravines all along here have been wintering grounds for many different nations, from Musqueam to Semiamu, Kwatlin, Katzi, Tawasin. Many nations have wintered here and as a result there are hundreds of artifacts along the, along the ground here right on the riverbank and up where the area is slated to be paved. It would really be a tragedy to lose this history. And many folks, including folks from the Musqueam Nation, say that this is sacred land as it is a, a burial ground for their ancestors. This is all part of the social and cultural destruction that is central to the building of this project. These are simply some of the things that are going to be lost.